Hello everyone, how are you? It's me, I'm back, Portia Shabalala. Um, today I want to read to you our Bible scripture uh, from when you know the angel Gabriel came to announce the birth of Jesus um, and we close off with when Mary visits Elizabeth. Why I'm sharing this Bible scripture with you? It's because, as you know, I'm a passionate Catholic um, and as Catholics we pray uh, our rosary. Yeah, we do. Um, I pray my every day. I try to. Sometimes I miss a day and that's okay. Uh, so one of the prayers we pray is the Hail Mary prayer, which says, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Yes. Um, so, the first part of the Hail Mary actually is based on those two important events when the angel Gabriel announced the birth of Jesus to Mary, Hail Mary, uh, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Um, and of course, when Mary visits Elizabeth and the baby in Elizabeth's womb leaps with joy. Yes. Um, so, I am going to read this Bible story um, for to you today. Uh, because actually the visitation of Mary to Elizabeth is one of my favorite scriptures um, and that is because for me that moment when the baby leaps with joy in Elizabeth's womb speaks to what we call in society you know that intuition that gut feeling for me it's the ability to know when you are in the presence of the Lord amen yeah how do you know that right now you're in the presence of the Lord it's when everything inside of you just leaps with joy yeah. so this is why this is one of my favorite Bible scriptures yeah so we shall read that today um, of course I have my Catholic study Bible um, as always and we are going to read the story from the gospel according to Luke uh, chapter 1 uh, from verse 26 to verse 45 and it reads in the sixth month the angel Gabriel sent from God to a town of Galilee called Nazareth to a virgin betrothed to a man named Joseph of the house of David and the virgin's name was Mary and coming to her he said hail favored one the Lord is with you but she was greatly troubled at what was said and pondered what sort of greeting this might be then the angel said to her do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. Behold, you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you shall name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called Son of the Most High. And the Lord God will give him the throne of David his father, and he will rule over the house of Jacob forever, and his kingdom there will be no end. But Mary said to the angel, how can this be, since I have no relations with a man? And the angel said to her in reply, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore, the child to be born will be called Holy, the Son of God. And behold, Elizabeth, your relative, has also conceived a son in her old age. And this is the sixth month for her who was called barren, for nothing will be impossible. God. Mary said, Behold, I am the handmaid of the Lord. May it be done to me according to your word. Then the angel departed from her. During those days, Mary set out and traveled to the hill country in haste to a town of Judah, where she entered the house of Zechariah and greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the infant leaped in her womb. And Elizabeth, filled with the Holy Spirit, cried out in a loud voice and said, Most blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And how does this happen to me, that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For at the moment, the sound of your greeting reached my ears, the infant in my womb leaped for joy. Blessed are you who believed that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. Amen. Yeah, so now you know, if you've been my Catholic, now you know where we get our Hail Mary prayer from. And so I shall close with the Hail Mary once more. 
and hear me only, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah, so that's what I'm sharing today. Thank you very much, and may God bless you.